Hey guys, we're back with a, another video and that I, I haven't uploaded in a long time. So, I have no idea where we're doing it. I'm a duo. Alright. Time to do something. So, I'm going to do it. you guys up. Pencil. Look at that lead. And piece of paper. So that's like a basic setup for art. I'm half off the screen. Um, so basic setup is just pencil and piece of paper. This is thick paper. And this pencil is paper mate. 0 0.7 millimeter. And it's a mechanical pencil. As you see. Look, it's bigger and bigger. Just like my life. Okay, these freaking beams of light keep getting in my face. Alright, so I'm a, I'm just gonna draw simple original landscape. So a lot of you should know what landscape landscapes are. But if you don't, landscapes are here. I got an art piece up here that I made, by the way. This is a landscape that I made yesterday. So, yeah, that's my signature. I got a poppy since Remembrance Day. Um, tree, uh, like stream with a gold bridge, another tree, some grass. So that's a basic landscape. So, just in case you didn't know, that that's what landscapes are. So I'm gonna do that. So. First, I gotta draw the water and the trees. This one, I'm not gonna add a bridge. Put in the comment. Wait, never mind. Okay, sorry. gonna be one tree as well so and then a doobie color window no bridge some grass no flowers it's gonna be basic and I'm gonna do a tutorial after this to draw some simple things if you don't know how to draw don't know how to draw I was about to roast people that don't know how to draw but it won't be really nice, so if you don't know how to draw, it's fine. You'll get taught. So, markers. I need blue. Which blue? I have a lot of blue choices. This one. The, no, that's orange. The raindrop blue. Can you see that? Focus. Okay. It says rain drop blue. So that's going to be the screen. I know my markers make this. Um, so. 
if you can hear that, like the video. <laughs> I'm just kidding. The freaking ink is coming, dude. I guess that makes it look more shiny. Tree time. I always use this color, which is the baby lime. Uh, if you want to get these, they're I don't know where they're from, but they're Crayola. Pip squeaks. It's probably how to make words. Pip squeak. And I never don't use tiny toad brown. I used total bronze for the bridge I did up there. So this will be the stem. For the bridge, as people like to call it. Yeah, pip squeak. They make that noise when you buy them, it's fine. They're called pip squeaks for a reason. Okay, that last bit. Yo. Bro, how did that happen? Oh my god, dude. Yeah, there we go, finally in. Sorry if you can hear that, that's just my brother. Um, that for the grass. I usually just scribble for the grass. That's what I did for the sketch for the grass. I'll show you the landscape when I'm done. Sorry if I'm taking too long of your time. Only eight minutes into the video, so I should be good. A little more. Okay, so ready to see the landscape? Three, two, one. Here it is. So nice. I mean, I like it. I'm looking at that one up there that I just showed you. But basic landscape you got the stream the tree I hopped it off and all the grass see what I said about the scribbling I like it it's definitely going up and I'll do the tutorial now so if, if you're a beginner if you want to draw a let's do a simple drawing if you want to draw, hmm. I don't know. I don't know what to draw. A simple, let's say poppy for Remembrance Day. So you would put two little things there. You would just go. It's okay if they're not like symmetrical. That's just how leaves are. Or 
flowers. And then you just you just keep adding on until it connects all the way together. So Then you do, I connected it all the way around. You do a circle in the middle. And I'm looking at that one for reference. You put lines off the circle. Kind of like this. All the way around. So all the way around the circle. Kind of looks like a sun. It won't for long. So, once you've done that, you will put little circles at the end of those lines that went off the circle. So, little circles, little circles, little circles, little circles, little circles, little circles. So, I, we're wasting your time. I just, I'm on a phone right now. So, don't really know how to cut the video. Um, if you want to add a stem, you can add a stem. If you don't want to add the stem, you could do whatever colors you want. That's basically the whole poppy. But if you want to add the stem, I'll show you. So, you would put a little curve off the bottom. And then you do really close another little line see and then the leaves will go so you put a little sideways bracket and then uh the same thing on the bottom and then you repeat that on the other side I do mine, I personally do mine a little lower. That kind of makes it look better, but you could do it whatever way you want. So yeah, that's the poppy. And see you guys in the next video. Bye.